days of Outmas. So today I'm doing a different video I'd say and it's something that I feel quite passionately about so I thought that I would put this video together because I think I'm kind of an expert when it comes to teeth whitening. I really do. So I have tried so many different methods over the last few years and some work, some don't and some are really not worth it. So this video is basically showing you all the different methods and how I felt about it basically. Um, so yeah, let's get right into the video. Firstly, let's talk about your toothbrush. Now, if you have a toothbrush like this, bin it because I really think that they're not very good at all. Now recently I invested in an Oral-B toothbrush and I think they're absolutely amazing. The head may seem small but oh my gosh it feels like you flossed, really cleaned your teeth and oh my goodness my teeth feel and look much more whiter if that makes sense. Now it's so easy, it's electric so it turns on and you can also change the head when you want and I think there's a few available. Now this one cost me £10 and they do other kind of variations, more expensive versions and I think next time I'll probably will go for the more expensive version because it was pretty amazing. Okay, toothbrushes out the way, let's now talk about product. I came across this brand because I'm into natural stuff and things that don't have peroxide in them and I love it when you know you read through the ingredients and it doesn't look like it's been made in a chemical factory full of rubbish basically. So I got this box and it's got a few really exciting products. Now this toothpaste you can see that I've used a lot, there you go, I've used quite a lot of it already. It is incredible. Now this Too Faced does have charcoal in it. Now charcoal is slightly abrasive on the teeth but not damaging. It just takes that slight bit of stainage off and your smile will look so much better. Now as you can see I've used quite a lot of it and I've been using it for about three weeks and oh my goodness my teeth look so much more whiter and compared to other whitening toothpaste that I've used on the market I've seen huge difference using this toothpaste. Now you can get this online, I'll leave a link in the description, um, but yeah, I'll show you the product itself. It is like a grey colour, as you can see, and it smells incredibly minty and it tastes really minty. I think it's one of the best tasting um, toothpaste that I've ever, ever tried, um, but yeah, 100% recommend this product. Mm, just tastes so good. Now this product is so intriguing, so instead of it being a toothpaste, it's a tooth foam. I have never tried a tooth foam in my life, but honestly, it is as good as toothpaste. Now, it's a pump, and as you can see, it kind of looks like you're using some sort of foam shower gel, and it smells, it smells fruity, I think, and it tastes a bit more, mm, a bit more fruity, not as minty as the toothpaste. Um, but again, it does a really good job. It cleans the teeth and it also helps to make your teeth a little whiter. Again, non-abrasive. It's really good for the teeth. And yeah, really like this product. It's so different. It's good to be different, I think. The next product is something great on the go. Now this is a tooth whitening spray. Yeah, tooth whitening spray, do I hear you say. Now this is great for on the go. So if you're traveling a lot or you just wanna like, I don't know, do some of you get conscious that you've got bad breath and you just kind of stick a chewing gum in? You don't have to do that, you could just spray it with one of these and it will whiten your teeth at the same time, so two in one. Easy peasy, just pop it into your mouth, just like that, or on your teeth, as whatever you want. But yeah, it doesn't taste as minty as the toothpaste again, but it does have that little minty taste. Um, yeah, I actually love this, I actually do keep this... Um, in my handbag, <laughs> really good like go-to product if I am, I don't know, in a rush, ran out of chewing gum, or traveling basically, I really do like it. Next are these whitening trays. Now whitening trays, I've had a mixed kind of experience with them. In the summer, I actually went to go and get uh, my teeth whitened and I went to this kind of teeth whitening bar where you sit down, they put the gel and the UV light on and you sit there for 20 minutes. Now when I came out of the treatment, I swear that my teeth look stripy. They look like a zebra. I was a bit concerned. I remember coming out thinking, 
oh my god, what have they done to my teeth? But this one's really, really good. I mean, it's very, very gentle and it's not got any peroxide in it. So I'll just show you really quickly. It's quite intriguing. They look like contact lenses, but for the teeth. Um, but as you can see, they have these little trays and all you do, you just peel them off and put it onto your teeth for about 35 minutes, um, top and bottom. And there's about, I think there's about 10, five pairs. Oh no, 10 pre-filled, yeah, so about five goes. Now, if you want more of an intensive treatment, you can actually use the uh, 10 trays over a five-day period. But if you just want a little, I don't know, pick me up, a little bit more of a whiter glow, then these are actually really good. They don't have any peroxide in them, and I did find that my teeth did look a little whiter after one use. Um, I didn't use them for the five days because I felt that my teeth didn't need it, but I really liked it. It was like, um, you know when you put a fake tan on, on your body. It's like putting that on, but for your teeth to make them white. <laughs> if that makes sense. Next up, we have teeth whitening pens. Now again, I do have mixed emotions on these because I think that this product entails a lot of patience and if you don't have a lot of that, you may struggle. Now, this product by Tint reminds me of a lip gloss or applying nail varnish. Now, as you can see, it looks just like a lip gloss. There we go. And you literally apply it onto the teeth like you are putting on nail varnish. Now, you do have to wait for them to dry because they do go a little bit, what do you call it when like nail varnish scuffs? Yes, yeah, scuffs because when it's wet. Um, so you do have to be careful of that. I do think that these are a really good kind of quick fix, a go-to product, um, but yeah, you do need to have patience with it though. Next up is bicarbonate of soda. Now I've heard loads of stories about using bicarbonate of soda because apparently it brightens your smile. Now I've been trying this um, for the last few weeks and do you know what? I kind of think it's true. I don't think it does like a massive, massive, I mean, improvement, but it does give that slight shine, if that makes sense. Now, the way I use this, I get my um, toothbrush and my toothpaste, then I just pop a bit of bicarbonate soda. I just think it makes it a little bit more abrasive um, to get rid of the stainage. But yeah, if you just want a cheaper alternative, bicarbonate soda is your girl. Next is the trusty mouthwash. Now, mouthwash, I really highly recommend flossing and then mouthwashing because, I don't know, I think I'm stuck in my ways, but I really do think that it's really good for your teeth. Now, I've been using Listerine Stay White, and I think this is my favorite one. I have used other uh, mouthwashes before, and I felt that they didn't give me much of a smile they didn't kind of whiten my teeth but I do find this one's really good not only does it make me feel like my teeth look a little whiter I don't know if it's got anything to do with the blue I don't know but it does do a massive massive improvement on my general health I find that it really does clean my mouth <laughs> um, but yeah I really love this product I do recommend using Listerine stay white Okay, this next product is very different. Now, it's teeth whitening oil, and what you do, you pop it into your mouth and swish around for 10 to 20 minutes. Now, I must admit, I do not do this a lot because swishing around for 10 to 20 minutes, I'm a chatterbox, I need to talk, and I can't keep my mouth quiet for that long. However, I have done it a couple of times. Um, I don't think it's my favourite method. I didn't think that it helped much, but I don't know. I think this one is more of a personal preference. I do recommend trying it at least, but I don't actually promise you any results, really. Last but not least, it is the Charcoal Toothpaste Powder. Now, I must admit, I don't use this all the time because it is flipping messy. Now, charcoal powder is slightly abrasive on the teeth, so it does get rid of that stainage, but, oh my gosh, like I say, it makes a right mess. Now, I'm just going to show you the product itself. Um, as you can see, you can see all the charcoal in there. But I find that it probably wouldn't last very long. So what I have been doing more recently is sprinkling a little bit on my toothpaste. And I find that is actually quite nice. Um, but yeah, <laughs> it's a very messy product. But again, I do think that it's really good for teeth whitening. But there we go, guys. I really hope you found this video useful. Like I say, I've pretty much tried every single angle and I have found 
other methods more better than others but I think it's more about trial and error on personal preference really. I really like the charcoal toothpaste. I absolutely love it. Be sure to follow me on all my social media sites, all the links to those are down below and do not forget to enter my massive YouTube prize giveaway because I am giving one of my viewers 40 plus prizes and all you have to do is subscribe to this channel and retweet my pinned tweet on Twitter. So if you hit that subscribe button now, you've pretty much already entered. Also, please let me know if you like this video and you want me to do more of this kind of style. Drop me a comment down below. I would love to hear your suggestions. But as always, guys, please make sure that you link, like, and subscribe. And I'll see you next time for another video. Goodbye. So you ready? Yes. Okay. Three, two, one, go. You're all wrong, go. You got it all wrong. Oh, I dropped one. Oh shit, oh, I'm sorry, I dropped two. Oh. I got three. You're popping me. No! I'm eating foil. <laughs> oh my god. Mmm, I'm stuffing it in.